Hi, welcome. So we will work a little bit into the arms today. Um, so definitely stretch the arms at the beginning. Grab three, five, eight, ten pound weights. Um, I'll let you know usually when to switch them out if you want or what I would recommend. I have three pound weights the entire time, but please know you can go stronger. All right, so first um, we'll start in standing position. Any position with the legs and we'll just stretch out the arms a little bit and shoulders. So take your time to roll your shoulders all the way back and down. You can start with small circles to start and take it forward, maybe one arm and then the other or both. Take bigger circles forward. So maybe bent arms, bent elbows, or straight arms. And go to a pace that feels comfortable for you. So if you're energized and you wanna go faster, feel free. If you wanna go slower and really dive in, feel free. Now rotate back. Still lengthen through your side body, all the energy moving up towards the ceiling. Maybe try a couple with straight arms. All right, and then slowly release. Let's take our left arm out to the side, make sure it's straight. And then flex your hand, take your right ear, right shoulder, lift your chin up and just breathe. And opposite side. Back to center, shake out your arms forward and back. You can take low, big wingspan, maybe to the middle or up and down. All right, and then let's take a side body stretch to reach your hands up high to your sky. Grab your left wrist and bend right. Back to center and other side, bend left. Back to center, relax your hands down, rotate your shoulders once again. Let's get into a little bit of the legs, warrior two through the legs, so you can bend your right knee, step back to your mat, warrior two, arms up to your teeth. Reverse triangle, reach all the way up and back. Extended side angle, reach all the way overhead. Reverse warrior. Warrior two, and switch out your legs, just bend your left knee. Reverse triangle, extended side angle. Reverse warrior, and warrior two. Turn your toes out, heels in, chest expansion behind you, knuckles go down, and fold, hinge at your waist. Relax your hands down, inhale, halfway lift. Right palm is your base, left arm goes high. On the other side, find your twist. Back to center, hands to the hips, all the way up to standing. Shorten your stance. Feet either hips with distance or together to touch. Three heart lifts, inhale, reach all the way up. Open mouth, exhale, melt your elbows down, lift your heart. Two more, inhale, reach all the way up. And big exhale, all the way down. One more, reach up. And deep exhale. Cross your right hand across your chest, hook with your left, and take your left ear, left shoulder. And back to center, another side, cross your left arm, bump your left shoulder down, hug in your right, right hand to the left arm, right your right shoulder. And then back to center, take your feet in hips with distance, you can step to the top of your mat, inhale, reach all the way up high to your sky. 
And exhale, fold, hinge at your waist, drop your body down, ragdoll pose, let your body hang heavy. You can grab opposite elbows here. And release your hands down to your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Always engage legs, glutes, back. And exhale, fold. One more, inhale, halfway lift. And exhale, fold. Walk your big toes together to touch. You could toss in a chair pose. Bend your knees, arms up high. Open arm twist, right hand back, left hand forward. Inhale, chair pose, and other side. Twist. Inhale, chair pose. Airplane your arms. Reach up. And exhale, fold. Halfway lift. And step your left leg back, low lunge. Drop your back knee, hands into the right thigh. Press your hips slightly forward. Hands to your heart center. As you exhale, twist, right hand goes back behind you. Hands to your heart center, interlace your fingers. Reach your arms up high to the sky, hips forward. And half split, straighten out your right leg. Runner's lunge, hands to the inside of your right leg, right foot to the outer edge. Quad stretch, bend your back knee, right hand to your top foot. And other side, tabletop position. So runner's lunge on the left. So big swoop forward, quad stretch. Back to center, walk your left foot more to the middle. Hands to your left thigh. So always focus on the ground, energy moving in, your core nice and active, and then reach your hands to your left sky. Then to your heart center. Open arm twist, left hand back. Hands to your heart center. Interlace your fingers, reach your arms overhead, press up. Hands go down, high plank pose. All the way down to your belly. Tend your feet and fingertips wider than your mat. Inhale, lift up cobra. Then just bump your right shoulder down to the middle till you feel a stretch. Back up and left shoulder down. One more time each round or each side. Cobra pose, hold three, two, hover down. Hands down by your side, tabletop position, all fours, hands and knees. Take your thread of the needle, inhale your right arm high, and thread your needle, right shoulder down, right ear down. Left hand by your ear, inhale your right arm high and tabletop other side. Left arm high, and thread your needle left side. Right hand by your ear, inhale left arm high. Tabletop, downward facing dog. Walk your hands to the back of your mat. Roll all the way up to standing. Step to the long part of your mat once again. We go into a quick sun bead flow once again. Warrior two, right knee bends, arms out to a T, inhale reverse triangle. Extended side angle, let's invite a bind. Left hand goes behind the lower back, half, or full right hand underneath. So your option here, hold three. Slowly release your bind, inhale reverse warrior, and triangle pose. Good. 
Gaze down, extended side angle. Rebend right knee. Reach both hands in front of you. Hold three, two, and warrior two. Rise up. Other side, switch out your legs. Inhale, reverse triangle. Straighten out, up and back. Extended side angle. And take your half or full bind. Half is right hand behind you. And full is left hand underneath. Take your time, inhale, reverse warrior, unwind, left arm high, and triangle pose, straighten out legs, reach forward, left hand to a hover, right hand high. Then back to center, warrior two, and slowly shorten your stance. So we can up the arms just a little bit more. Let's take our left foot back behind us. So really light weights or no weights is what I'll cue to. So no weights here, take your elbows by the side, just thumbs up, or rather thumbs down, pinkies up, and exhale, squeeze in. Lengthen, squeeze, lengthen, squeeze. So just warming up the arms. You can feel a little bit of resistance as you push back and squeeze in. We're just here for six, five, We'll keep the arms straight in four, three, two, and one. Keep arms straight, just flip hands, pump forward and back. Now we really begin to tune into your breath. So you can feel your exhale, exhale. Last six, five, four, three, two, and one. Go close your arms. Step your feet forward and just circle lightly. Six, five, four, three, two. Circle opposite way. So even with no weights, this is, you should be feeling pretty warm into the shoulders. We're here for six, five, four, three, two, one. Step your left leg back, elbows by the side. Just pause, breathe. All right, let's lengthen all the way overhead. Reach, hover down, reach, hover down. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Stretch your arms out to a T. Big hug forward and out, hug forward and out. So this will be our last exercise to warm up the arms and then we're gonna warm up our core and then we're gonna add the weights. So we're here for six, five, four, three, two, and one. Step forward, shake that side out. Let's get all the way down onto our back for a little bit of core. So core, always super important to engage, even when we're working completely arms or completely legs, stabilizes us, stabilizes us in the center. Let's take our hands behind the back of our head, short set here, lift your chest up, let your head hang heavy to the palms. If you have a block, you can squeeze it between the inner thighs, lift up a little bit more. Hover, hold, exhale, lift, hold, hover, hold, lift, hold. Three more and then we add on, lift, squeeze, two more. Lift, squeeze, and pulse. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hover, lift, hold, pulse. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Hover, lift, hold, pulse. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hover, lift, hold, pulse, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You've got it. Hover, hold, lift, hold, and pulse. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Hover, lift, hold, pulse, five, four, three, two, one. Hover. Lift, hold, and pulse. Three, two, one. I might have skipped a couple numbers. 
Exhale, lift, hold. Two, one, hover down. Exhale, lift, hold, pulse lift, hover down. Great job. Take your knees in line with your hips. Now take your legs long and exhale in. Tiny lift of your tailbone using your lower belly. So right now it doesn't matter how low you go. Just feel the lower belly move in and up. We're just here for six, five, four, three, two, back to those crunches. Feet go down, lift your chest, hold, and pulse. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, hover, lift. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, hover, lift. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, hover, lift, 10. Keep going because you have the pace. Lower back presses down, hover, lift, pulse 10. Hover, lift, pulse 10. Just a few more rounds, lower back down, hover, lift, pulse 10. Great job, last one, hover, lift, higher, pulse 10. Drop your head down, hands down by your side. Take your wrists by your glutes, take your knees in, extend your legs low diagonal in, low diagonal in. Faster, slow your choice, you know they can always take one leg at a time. 10, Go slower 
If you have lighter set of weights, even the three pound weights, know they can pick up the pace and go faster and ignore my count. All right, last set here. Weights to the shoulders. Step your feet up a little bit wider, toes out. Take your weights in front of you and exhale either both arms at a time, squeeze back, or one arm at a time, pull back. So you're gonna flip the palm forward and back. Forward, back. Just six, squeeze five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna add a little bit of a squat variation. Wider than your hips and toes point forward. Let's go down to the ground, shoulders back, lift up, pause, and lift. If you want a smooth transition, down, lift. So your choice, I will cue to the pause. So as you shift back, weight into the seat, hover forward, lift, and down. So avoiding punching over or letting your heart lead the way down towards the ground. Really find your feet, glutes, back work. Once you feel a pace that's good for you, you can go faster or slower, your choice. Be proud of yourself. You still have the same weight size or heavy weights or you just keep moving here. And we have three more sets. We'll switch to lighter weights in two. And one. So now that we will take rows, but lighter set of weights hold better when you use them both in one hand. So your left hand has the one heavy weight or two light set of weights. Bend your right knee, inhale, hover down, row back, hover, row. Feel your obliques work, big exhale as you row back, and a short set here for six, five, four, three, two, and switch out the arms, switch out the legs, inhale, hover, row back, and row. All right, last two, last one. Nice, since we have our lighter set of weights, we'll go ahead and grab them. Take the weights off to the side, shoulders back and belly in. All right, let's bring the goalpost arms. Arms go overhead. Let's wrap in and press. So you can go a little bit faster if you like. And if you want to step one leg back, feel free, press. We're here for 10. If you choose heavier set of weights, just go slower. Keep breathing, three more. All right, you've got this light set of weights, arms out to a mini W, and circle six, five, four, three, 
two, and hug your arms in. Nice. Shake out your shoulders, switch out the legs if you need to. Take your elbows by your side, palms face up. We're just rotate cross, exhale cross. Inhale, exhale. So since we have our lighter set of weights, we will take narrow rows again and wide flies. The wide flies take your time. Here we go. Last one, step your feet in hips with distance. Narrow rows in front of you, pull back, hover forward, wide, hover back, hover wide. Keep going here, 10. Keep going, almost done here. Three more sets. All right, all the way up to standing. Shoulders go back. So one more exercise with the arms and then we're gonna cool it down. So take your feet um, out wide, bend your knees. We're gonna take punches towards the screen. Shoulders back, here we go, right and left side, punch it out. You could go as slow or as fast as you like. Protect the rib cage every time we drive back. Now we're here for 10 and then we'll add a hook in eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, pause, add a hook right in front of the face, hover back. Forward, each side. Hook, and hook. Now if you want to go faster, hook, hook. Just six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now uppercuts. Take it up, hold, up, hold, up, hold, up, hold. Know that you can go faster if you like. Take your time. Shorter set here for six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. All the way up to standing. Still a little bit more push-ups. So go ahead, drop the weights here. I'll cue to the knees so I can talk the whole time, but know that you can uh, straight legs the whole time. If you have straight legs, widen up legs to the outer edges of your mat. Widen out your feet or your hands. Shift your weight forward. We pulse first. Inhale forward, halfway down, and tiny pulse. Ten. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Straighten out the arms. Shift your weight back. Pause. Our second variation. Halfway down and up. Here we go. Shift your weight forward. Halfway down and up. Down. Lift. Down. Lift. Eight. Seven. Know that you can go slower if you're on off of the knees. Last four, three, two, and press back. Our last set, we're gonna mix it up. Pulse, pulse, and press up. So here we go. Inhale, shift your weight forward. Halfway down, pulse, pulse, press up. Halfway down, pulse, pulse, press up. Maybe try a few with the legs straight. We're just gonna take four more. Halfway down, pulse, pulse, press up. Halfway down, pulse, pulse, press up. Halfway down, pulse, pulse, press up. Two more, pulse, pulse, press up. 
One more pulse, pulse, press up. Awesome job, you guys. Come to a seat, shake that side out. All right, so know that you can replay the video and take it another round. You can take it four more rounds. You can switch it up, whatever you choose, maybe a leg um, video. So just a short warm up for you guys and take your time to stretch out your arms, take your time to breathe and enjoy your journey. All right, thanks for tuning in and I will see you soon. Aloha.